How to find fractional or relative error in change in length? Absolute and relative error are two types of error with which every experimental scientist should be familiar with. Absolute error is the amount of physical error in a measurement. Mathematically, absolute error is equal to delta x where x is any variable or quantity being measured. The fractional or relative error is the value of the absolute error divided by the value of the quantity, that is, fractional error is equal to delta x divided by x. The fractional error multiplied by 100 gives percentage error. Relative error gives an indication of how good a measurement is relative to the size of the thing being measured. Let's solve an example to find the fractional error. Question. A person measures the depth of a well by measuring the time interval between dropping a stone and receiving the sound of impact with the bottom of the well. The error in this measurement of time is delta t equals to 0.01 seconds and he measures the depth of the well to be L equal to 20 meters. Take the acceleration due to gravity g equal to 10 meter per second square and the velocity of sound is 300 meter per second. Then the fractional error in the measurement delta L upon L is closest to this question was asked in JEE Advanced 2017 exam. Solution We are given Depth of well equal to 20 meters Acceleration due to gravity equal to 10 meter per second square Velocity of sound equals to 300 meters per second Error in time Delta T equal to 0.01 seconds In this question the person is standing near a well and drops a stone and after some time he hears the sound of splash. Time taken by the stone to reach the water level. T1 is equal to square root of 2L divided by G. Time taken to hear the sound of impact with the water in the well. T2 is equal to L divided by V. Therefore, total time T1 plus T2 is equal to square root of 2L by G plus L by V. On differentiating this with respect to length, we get delta T equal to square root of 2 by G into 1 by 2 root L into delta L plus 1 by V into delta L. Taking delta L common, our expression becomes delta T equal to delta L into square root 2 by G into 1 by 2 root L plus 1 by V. Or delta L equal to delta T upon square root 2 by G into 1 by 2 root L plus 1 by V. On substituting the given values, Delta L comes out to be 0 0.1851. Fractional error in the measurement is equal to Delta L upon L into 100. On putting the values of Delta L and L, fractional error equals to 0.93%, which is close to 1%. Hence, option B is correct. Please like, share and comment on the video and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. For more interesting and educational videos to earn while you learn, download Extra Class app from Google Play Store and get rewarded for studying.